City South today, Chichester. Well done, Major Brilliant. Mick. We're right behind you. Go for it. And he'll want good weather, Sarah. Indeed. He's got till Christmas. There'll be some good days in there, I'm <laughs> sure. Um, beautiful pictures today. A glowing start at Ferndown Common this morning. Thank you very much to Rosemary Crouch. What a sky here. Look at that. Very ominous, though. At Brill in Buckinghamshire, Victoria Timms captured that. And some sunshine in Selsey. Merrin Woodland sent that one in. So we did see some sunshine. We also saw some wet weather. We saw some mist in parts first things as first thing as well. And this scene was captured beautifully here by our weather watcher Ken Rayner. Now across the weekend we will have quite a mixed bag. Some more of those showers, perhaps heavy, maybe even thundery, and there will be some sunny skies to enjoy as well. The winds look to settle down a bit into Sunday. Through the course of this evening, any of those showers do look to fade away, so becoming dry overnight tonight with clear skies across the region and temperatures likely to take a tumble as a result, down to three or four in our towns and cities. Perhaps some rural spots, maybe in the Chilterns, may see a touch of frost, but most of us will avoid that frost courtesy of the breeze. So it's a chilly and bright start to the day for Saturday, a good deal of sunshine early on, maybe some hazy cloud building for westernmost parts in particular. The afternoon is where we see these showers arriving and they have the potential to be on the heavy side, possibly with a rumble of thunder, maybe some hail in the mix and the winds likely to whip up as well so we're looking at gusts of around 30 to 40 miles per hour even inland temperatures are likely to peak at 13 or 14 degrees through the day on saturday your inshore waters for selsey bill to lime regis valid from midday tomorrow till midday on sunday the winds will be west veering northwest four to six and visibility will be good on ahead then to Sunday and it does look to be the quieter day of the weekend. We're set to see quite settled conditions, perhaps one or two showers, but most of us staying dry and a good deal of sunshine. Temperatures likely to be up to around 13 or 14 degrees once more. Then fast forward to next week and the new working week brings us a new weather system courtesy of this area of low pressure. We're going to see quite cloudy, maybe misty skies first thing before we see further spells of rain pushing in. Perhaps a little bit of clearance just towards the end of the day on Monday. On ahead to Tuesday and it does look like we'll see one or two showers in the mix but there will be a good deal of dry weather, quite a bit of cloud around as well as we head into Wednesday. Sarah, thanks very much. Uh, that's it from us. Uh, have a good weekend, whatever you're doing. And uh, thanks for watching this week. We'll do it all over again starting on Monday. Be with us then if you can. Good night. Bye-bye.